Hey everybody, welcome to episode lucky 13 of our adventures with Lindsay here. We are about to uh, set sail for the new world, in our mind, Duratar, and uh, deliver a sealed package to someone on the other side of the journey we're about to take. I just have to figure out... Hey Chog. Hey bud. There you go. This I need. Blacksmithing hammer I might require at some point. <laughs> to whom do I speak? Gotta be on the ship already, right? Captain's quarters, I would assume. Hello? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Hello? Who's in charge of this mess? Besides me. Keep your ears to the ground. Is he? They're sassy. Okay, sassy, let's go. <gasps> oh. Did I get a movie? Or do I just wash up on a new shore? Here we go, great big world. I'm free to do what I like now. Here I am in Duratar. I made it. Ooh. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Hi. Oh, can't move yet. Run in place, though. That I can do for sure. Do, do, do. Load, load, load. Whoa! Hello. <laughs> there we are. Hello, Duratar. I'm not going to be shy. Here's your sealed package. Mm -hmm. Stay away from the voodoo. Deliver the ammo to High Overlord Surfer. Oh, looks like we're going to Ogremar. Bye bye now. Wee. All right, let's take a look at what's going on here. The Dranashar blockade. Blockade. Whoa! Torrens. Orcs. Trolls. Hi, I am a goblin. I am your friend. I think that was an undead that ran by. Hey everybody. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Hard to tell. Everything's going by so fast. Wow, look at all this. I'm really in the thick of it, eh? Oh, here's Orgrimmar. Hey. Major city. Oh, and decorated for annual candy holiday, whatever it's called. Mm -hmm. Hello. Okay, there's an inn over there. Yeah, 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 but first, let me just sneak over to this inn real quick. Get a new home. Oh, I get some candy. Obra. Hi. I'd love to. Here I am in Orgrimmar. Candy bucket. Handful of treats. Yay! I trick and treated. Let's take a look at what happened. All right, quest item. Let's open up my treats. I got. Pyroblast cinnamon ball, five of them, and a tricky treat. Dangerously sweet sugar frosted taffy with a sinister syrup center with a one second cooldown. Let me go ahead and wolf down all these. Sugar rush, increase speed by eight seconds. Cool. Whee! Oh boy, 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 oh boy. Invisible. Sneaky. <laughs> whoa. whoa, hello. 
Whoa. Hello, everyone. I guess it would be rude to be sneaky in here. Hi. Hi, friends. Hmm. Maybe less friendly. Hi. Hey, everybody. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Hi. Sylvanus Windrunner. Here's this emblem. Sorfang. Sorfang. Mm hmm. We are the true might of Whoa! Animal. Something happened and I got an epic upgrade to that chess piece. That's interesting. So now it's a level 27 item that I can wear. I mean. Okay. I didn't even know that was possible. My first purple at level 15 without even doing anything. That's very interesting. Very interesting indeed. There, I've done it. And so now, I am free to do whatever the heck I want. In this great big world. Alright, let's go check out the city. Oh, how do I get out of here? Let's go check out the city. <laughs> now the goblins are welcome. I feel welcome. Hey, everybody. Okay, that's my inn. <laughs> what is this place? Oh, the auction house, eh? Let's see. I don't know how much money I have. It's not showing anywhere. I'll have to figure that out later. Oh, maybe I can do it under character. Character. Reputation. Didn't it used to have currencies under here, or am I crazy? Hmm. I will have to find out later. Oh, maybe I can... Cha -ching! Sure. Well, there we go. I have two gold, and so on and so forth. Let me just see the average price of what a weapon would run me. Got to be something I can use. Okay, so slightly shy of what I have. Good gracious. What about a one-handed sword? Wow. That's... I don't understand. These must be here for some sort of crazy placeholder item. Why would an, a level 9... Sorry, an item level 14 be 400 gold? Warglaze doesn't help me. Fist weapons won't be this low. Wands. I don't think I can use wands. Hmm. If you ever need any... Yeah, it looks like if I ever need anything, I'm going to have to save for years and years. Okay, let's continue to explore. All these people have... Th Whoa, hello, let me stay out of your way. All these people have things for me to do, but I don't... I don't necessarily know who to really associate myself with. I just got to this city. I might never see my home again. It's a lot for me to take in. Just me and my little rolling luggage ball. Out in the great big world now. Okay. Oh, this looks fun. What's this beeps and whoops? What's going on here with your fun lights? Oh, I know what this is. A transmogrifier. I would like to transmogrify my gear, please. Yeah, a hidden cloak. Well, that cost me nothing. That's fun. Wow, that's... That's a pretty steep price just to change the look of stuff. I can't afford this yet. Hmm. That's interesting. What could I hide there? I didn't know I could hide those. You can hide your bracers now. Hide your gloves. Interesting. Hide your belt. Can't hide your pants. But just to get pants that match, it would cost me a gold. That's very strange. 
Oh, that reset everything. Oh no, just the pants. I can hide in my boots and have sneaky feats. Wow. Oh, I guess this is any uh, dagger that any of my characters have collected. Okay, that's why it looks so funky. I have so many options. Even just a, an effect is every, every little thing is a gold. So I'll just hide my cloak for now, I guess. It is a little embarrassing how ridiculous my outfit looks now that I don't have a cloak to hide most of it, but that's a shame I shall live with, because the stats are the bestest of the bestest. Especially my chest piece is ridiculous. Okay. Where do I go to find... Oh, let me go find a forge and hammer on some copper. There's gotta be something I can ask. Let me ask this guard. Hi. If I were, say, a blacksmith, burning anvil in the Valley of Honor down the path to the right, past Red Canyon Mining. Go forth to victory. Okay, so I go around the drag and I go through a thing. Okay. Thank you. Let's go do that. Wee. All right, so we scoop around the drag and then stick to the right. And then follow that little golden arrow. I wonder why they call us the drag. Doesn't seem that bad. Hmm. Traveling gear. Oh, maybe he has. You have bags? I need more bags. What do you need? Yeah, you have bags. Wow. Um, ooh. Yay, I think we just go ahead and do, do, do all these tiny little logos. Bag changer. Okay, now I'm full. I know I'm full. Woo, thank you very much. I appreciate that. I wish I could give you cinnamon ball to say thanks. But now, I at least have a full <laughs> row of bags to start with. Here's all these things. I don't this stuff. Actually, you can do me a solid favor. And you can buy that for me. Thanks, buddy. Yours neither. All right. What a great trip into the city. Woo! Got some extra bags. Now I got more room for the loot that I will acquire. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, I go through here to the Valley of Honor, I want to say. That's what I'm looking for. I don't even know where to start. Look at this place. Yeah, Valley of Honor. You know what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'm going to investigate this profession thing. This is going to be a slightly shorter episode. I'm going to investigate this professions over here, see what I can do that wise, and then put a pause on the gameplay because when we come back, or when I come back in episode 14, we're going to try out, see if we can get into Rage Fire Chasm for fun. See how that goes. All right, where do I need to be? There's another inn over there. I can make it specifically this part. Blue. Oh, a daily quest. Must be fishing related, I would think. I might do a little fishing later. Oh, man. Hi, turtle. Oh, nice knee pads. <laughs> All right, what do we got going over here? Yes. Hi. I came to use your equipment. Anvil. Anvil. 
forge, please. I believe. I think I need a forge. Forge? Hello. There we go. Okay. Let's mine some copper. Let's melt some copper. Pardon me. Alright. So, like I said, gonna take care of this copper. I'll try to get my mining skill up a little bit. I can't believe I made it to the city already. Unlock dungeons. I'm very excited. So after I get this over with, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. Hmm. As soon as this turns gray. Count down with me now. 39. Yee, it's going to take a while. I wish they could somehow... No, I guess you have to do it yourself. I was going to say, I wish they somehow made a way that you could sort of off-load your professions. But what do you actually learn if you were to give your raw materials to someone else and have them smelt the copper for you? That's not the way of things. That's not how it should work. But they really, I think, need to find a way to make the professions, I don't want to say more robust, but maybe more significant as you go through the game. Like, I'm only doing this because I know that I should probably max out the number of my mining profession before I level up my mining profession to the next batch once I get off the main world and stuff, right? Like, I think that's what most people do is just level it up for the sake of leveling it up. Please prove me wrong in the comments or with links or tell me what an idiot I am about World of Warcraft in general and this in particular. All right, so now we got a big stack of copper bars. That's fun. We still can't really do anything in terms of the arc light spanner, but I can find, now that I smelted all that, someone to talk to to find the enchanting trainer. Or not the enchanting trainer, pardon me, the engineering trainer. Hopefully they're nearby. Mining and jewel crafting. Hmm. Luktar. Whoa. Train. Train. Okay. Safe. Thank you. I appreciate that. Mining went up. Oh, here's a guard. Or a grunt, excuse me. Sub, sub. Excuse me. Where can I go and become a better engineer? Thank you for marking location. Hmm. Back to the drag. Cool, I gotta run by this turtle again. What up, turtle? Still digging the knee pads. Could be a different turtle. Alright. That pops the map way too many times. Back to the drag. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, I'm excited to have a new home base here in Ogrimmar. I'm not excited to team up with four strangers to do a dungeon later, to be perfectly honest. i see if I can do something about that, but for now... Oh, almost there. Hello! Oh, the machine shop. Makes sense. Hi. Sure. Teach me everything. Everything I need. Woo! So now, engineering. Arc light spanner. I'll take one of these, please. Requires an anvil. I will not take one of those, please. Blasting powder and copper bolts. Interesting. There's no anvil nearby? Yeah, there is. Okay. Engineering. Arc light spanner. Yes! Excellent. Copper bomb. Blasting powder. Hmm. Ooh. Go ahead and make all of these. Alright, so not the most exciting end of the video. But, here I go. Not even facing the anvil. Spinning and winning. Making copper bolts like crazy. Hey, 
<laughs> bing bong, bing bong. Hang on. What's up? You got anything else you can teach me to be better? Thank you. See you around, friend. Anything I can do with that? The scope? What do I need? Hmm. Malachite, copper bars. I have 17 bolts. Let me do three more bolts. Oops. Bolt one. Bolt two. Three bolts. There we go. Now I have an assortment. Okay. And before, what on earth is that little lobster? Okay, it's a crawfish person. Oh, horrors. Just horrors. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to run down. I'm in the drag, essentially. Where does this go? There, this looks foreboding. This must be where the place. Luggage. Luggage is with me. I got room. <laughs> oh, this looks safe. Oh, dear, oh, dear. The Cleft of Shadow. Hmm. Oh, it's got a mailbox. It can't be that bad. If they'll deliver mail here, it can't be too unsavory. You know what I mean? So. All right. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Where is it? I know it's somewhere. I know it's close by. Just show me where it is. You know what I'm talking about. There it is. Ah ha ha. All right, a lot of milestones here. We've we've hit level 15. We've unlocked the potential for dungeons and we are now staring into the face of the meeting stone and the entrance for Ragefire Chasm. So you know what that means. I want to thank everybody for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you feel like it. Please leave a comment, positive or negative. I love reading them either way. We love reading them either way. Uh, if you'll stick around, you can see all the ways you can support us. And like I said, thank you for watching. And as always, try to be nice to each other out there, okay?